Hello, this is Nick with Nick'sComputerFix.com and here's a video on how to scan a document into your computer from the Canon MIXMA MG2522 printer. Okay, to start with, let me point out a few things here. The printer that I used in this video is part of the MG2500 series and it's the Canon PIX MA MG2522. Now let's go ahead and print something and go over to the printer. And as you can see, it is already printing out the Windows printer test page for us. And it prints really quick, folks, in my opinion. As you can see, it's not taking Oh, hardly any time at all to print this out and just in a few seconds it is done so let's go ahead and grab this test print that I just printed out on this printer here and as you can see the print is very crisp and the blacks and grays and blues are very well defined now I'll place the test page right on the scanner there and let the lid drop down nice and lightly now starting out on our windows desktop let's go down to our start menu and left click on that and then we can go ahead and scroll down to the categories and you should see the canon utilities go ahead and click on that on the arrow the drop down arrow that is and you'll see you scan utility left click on that and that'll open up this little window here and it gives you the ability to, to auto scan you can scan in a photo a document custom you can stitch you can um, open up the scan center um, right now um, if you want to you can also read the instructions but right now I'm gonna just um, click on document which will scan this test page into my computer as a document and the very next message is scanner is warming up do not open the document cover and then the next message is scanning do not open the document cover and let me tell you people this scans very quickly this only took a, a couple of seconds and then it tells me the scan is complete and I can at this point I can go ahead and scan another document or test page or whatever into my computer if I want to but I don't so I'm gonna click on exit which automatically opens up the Canon my image garden utility because it's installed during the setup and as you can see I've scanned um, this test document into the computer um, a number of times the last one here is the most um, recent one that I just scanned in and down here I can go ahead and click on create or edit PDF file and then I can go ahead and add another page if I wanted to or rotate or even delete the page but right now I'm just going to click on save and when I do that will open up this little window here which gives me the opportunity to rename the file before it gets saved to my computer and I'm gonna go ahead and name it scan 47 um, you can certainly name it anything you like and also by the way I can set up a password security on this file also through this utility okay clicking on save and it's saving and that happens really quick um, in a future video, I'll go over this utility in more depth, uh, but right now um, you can see that it has um, quite a number of things that you can do within this um, uh, My Image Garden utility. All right, closing that out, closing this out, and let's go ahead and open up File Manager so that I can open up the PDF file within Adobe Reader and I'll click on the left hand side here documents within file manager and on the right hand side on the very first line top of the list you can see scan47.pdf which is the file that we um, scanned into this um, computer here um, through the scanner on the printer 
and saved it via the my image garden all right i'm gonna double click on this and that opens it up within adobe acrobat reader for me and chances are very good that you have adobe acrobat reader installed on your computer also where you can view it read it and print it if you like okay we've come to the end of this video thanks for watching Subscribe if you like and leave a like if you like. And remember to share.